Paladin M109A6 is a cannon artillery system with self-propelled howitzer developed by the Ground System Division of United Defense LP, now BAE Systems Land and Armaments. It manufactured at the Paladin Production Operations Center at Chambersburg, Pennsylvania. Paladin was first fielded in 1994, is operational with the United States Army and the Israeli Army, and has been selected by the Kuwait and Taiwan. The widely used M109 carries a 155mm howitzer and is the principal self-propelled artillery support for U.S. Army divisions. It is a large track vehicle with a fully traversable turret and prominent bustle. Early variants had a short 23 caliber barrel. Later versions, including the M109A6 Paladin, have a 39 caliber barrel. The M109A6 Paladin is the latest advancement in 155mm self-propelled artillery. The system enhances previous versions of the M109 by implementing onboard navigational and automatic fire control systems. Paladin has both a Kevlar line chassis and a pressurized crew compartment to guard against ballistic, nuclear, biological, and chemical threats. The Paladin can operate independently. From on the move, it can receive a fire mission, compute firing data, select and take up its firing position, automatically unlock and point its cannon, fire and move out, all with no external technical assistance. Firing the first round from the move in under 60 seconds, a shoot and scoot capability protects the crew from counter-battery fire. The M109A6 Paladin is capable of firing up to four rounds per minute to ranges of 30 kilometers. The Paladin features increased survivability characteristics, such as day or night operability, NBC protection with climate control, and secure voice and digital communications. The crew remains in the vehicle throughout the mission. The M109 has a crew of six, commander, gunner, driver, and three ammunition members. The hull is made of all-welded aluminum armor, which protects against small arms fire and shell splinters. The driver is seated at the front left of the hull, with the power pack to the right and the turret at the rear. The driver is provided with a single-piece hatch cover that opens to the left with three M45 day periscopes in front. These can be covered with small metal flaps to prevent damage. One of the day periscopes can be replaced by a passive night vision periscope. The Detroit diesel model 8 V71T engine is coupled to an Allison Transmission XTG 411 for a cross-drive transmission. The all-welded aluminum armor turret at the rear of the hull has a square hatch in each side that opens to the rear and twin doors in the turret rear. The commander is seated on the right side of the turret and has a cupola that can be traversed through 360 degree, a single-piece hatch cover that opens to the rear, and an M27 day periscope. A 50 caliber M2 heavy barrel machine gun is pintle mounted on the front of the cupola. The gunner is seated on the left side of the turret and has a square single piece hatch cover that opens to the right. The twin doors at the rear of the turret are provided for ammunition resupply. Mounted at the rear of the hull on each side of the hull door is a large spade that is manually lowered to the ground before firing. They are normally deployed only when firing top charges. The M109 is fitted with night vision equipment, but does not have nuclear, biological, and chemical warfare protection. The vehicle can be fitted with an amphibious kit consisting of nine airbags, four on each side of the hull, and one at the front. The bags are inflated from the vehicle, which can then propel itself across rivers on its tracks at a maximum speed of four miles per hour. The main armament is a 155mm M126 howitzer in an M127 mount with a fume extractor and large muzzle brake. Gun elevation and depression and turret traverse are hydraulic with manual controls for emergency use. The PM modernization effort is a significant upgrade of the M109 A6 Paladin, which includes buying back space, weight, and power cooling. While the self-propelled howitzer's cannon will remain unchanged, it will sport a brand new chassis, engine, transmission, suspension, steering system, to go along with an upgraded electric ramming system.